Hey guys, me and Matt are here today to bring you another video. Today we're going to be doing the two truths and one lie challenge. So the way it works, if you've never heard of it, is we're going to be telling each other three statements. Two of them will be true, one of them will be a lie. The other person has to figure out which one is the lie. Every time they do, uh, they get a point. Whoever gets the most points wins. So, uh... How about we start with you, Matt? Okay. So you read uh, me yours. Yep. So we're each going each to do five. Um, each of them, each going to do five uh, for a total of ten and all that. Yep. Uh, just each let you guys five. know. Just let you guys know. Uh, we do not have a prize for the winner. So <laughs> winning is bragging rights. <laughs> anyway. A winning is bragging rights on YouTube. You get proof that you won. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So. So you guys get to know a bit about us. So. And we're also doing this separately. We, we usually would be in person, but because of the quarantine, it's going to be separate. Yep. Okay. So let's start with yours. So my first three are: um, I was a Boy Scout for five years. I have had two dogs, four cats, and eight fish in total. Damn. And I recognized three days on my birthday. You. What was the last one? I recognized three days on my birthday. You recognize three days on your birthday? So not like Monday, Wednesday, or Tuesday. I mean like three different events happened on my birthday. Happened on my oh. birthday. That I you recognized. should have explained that one more. That's ex that's confusing. Yeah. Like, are you saying you have three different birthdays? Because I think I know which one is alive and... <laughs> yeah, I happen to, I happen to be... Uh, Hold on. No, don't say it. No. 44. I happen to be 44. 44? 18 times 3. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, hmm. So, Boy Scout for five years. Boy Scout for five years. How many pets you said? It like eight two, fish. Two dogs, and four stuff. cats, and eight fish. And I recognize three. Why do you have a dog body. and a cat right now? Hmm. Boy Scout for five. Actually, I think Boy Scout only has four years, doesn't it? Until you're 18. What? No, that's not Boy Scouts. Unless Indiana or Illinois has weirder rules. because of You might be thinking of Cub Scouts. Oh, Cub Scouts. They have four years. Okay, yeah. Boy Scouts that's starts when you're 11 and ends when you're 18. I'm going to say... The first one was a lie, the Boy Scouts. That is incorrect. Damn it. Which one was I lie? joined when I was 13. Uh, the lie was that I had two cats, four, uh, two dogs, four cats, and eight fish. Damn I've it. only had three cats. Damn it. That's such, sure. a, that's such a cool thing to do. Okay. So. Oh, you want to know the three things I recognize on my birthday? What? My birthday, tax day, and Abraham Lincoln's death. Oh, that's an I don't celebrate them. I recognize them. That's interesting. Three events. You also, the Titan also I believe the Titanic sank on my birthday. I don't think so. No, I didn't. No, it was uh, something happened. April fourteenth. It started sinking, but it finished sinking on April fifteenth at two a.m. <laughs> two forty a.m. Okay, cool. It finished sinking on my birthday. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, many but... people died on your birthday. <laughs> okay, so my first three statements are I got bitten by a dog right on the lips. I lived in a camping trailer for three months. And my first paying job was at Culver's. I'm pretty sure the third one is correct. Uh, is it as in it's the truth? I. I think you told me a story about how you got bitten by a dog on the lips. I want to say that I want to say it's either not been, it wasn't three months that you lived in a camping trailer. Or you just didn't live in a camping trailer. I'm going to say a second one's a, a lie. The second one. Yeah. Sorry. That is incorrect. Dang it. The lie was my first paying job was at Culver's. Oh, really? My first job was with uh, this guy named Mike. 
who uh, gave me a job putting insulation in an attic, and that was about a month. That's before. right. I made about eighty dollars for that. Um, okay. I did live in a camping trailer for three months because um, when I moved here, they didn't want to move out of the house, so we lived uh, in a camping no. trailer for three months. Okay. And then I got bitten by a dog right on the lips when I was like six. Because we had our neighbors across the street who had, like, the sunroom that had a dog in it. And uh, being the naive little child I was, they were like, oh, give him a kiss. So I went to go give him a kiss, and he bit me right in the lip. And my whole lip w almost came off, and I had to get stitches to fix it. So okay. okay. I just ran across the street yelling for my mom and put blood all over the house. So, you know, that was a fun experience. <laughs> Okay, you okay. This one this one's a doozy. Um I have been arrested. What? I have been in jail <laughs> and I've been in handcuffs. Well, the thing is you were in Illinois, so that's all very believable. <laughs> <laughs> I've been in I've been arrested. I've been in jail. Wait, that's the three I've statements? Huh? That's the three statements? I've been arrested, I've been in jail, and I have... Been Those all correlate very well. Yes. That's... Oh, come on. <laughs> this is one of my harder ones. I think this is the hardest one. This is definitely the hardest one. But if you're arrested, oh, then shit, how are you not in jail? Hard. But then, if you weren't in jail, how were you arrested? <laughs> I'm gonna say the handcuffs. That's your answer? Yes. That is incorrect. What was it? Um, so I have been in jail for a school field trip. They let us stand in. They let us. Oh be in come the jail. on! That is, that is, so low. <laughs> uh, my dad is. My dad works with the Cook County Sheriff's Department, so you know handcuffs kind of come with the deal. Yeah, it was the arrested one. It was yeah. I almost got arrested. I I never actually been arrested. You suck. My my sister got accused of stealing, and they were gonna arrest me and my sister because I was an accomplice. And then we went and said, "No, we aren't. <laughs> we didn't do it." Oh, you gave me an idea for a story for a part two video if we do do one, but I'm not gonna tell it now. Okay. Okay. Uh, my next sure. one. Yep, your next one. Okay. So I experienced hitting a bridge with a truck. I missed my brother's seventh birthday, and my old middle school and high school were connected to each other. Oh, I know the answer. What is you it? missed Alex's birthday? I don't know. Well, which one do you think is a lie? That's oh, a lie. No, you no, you didn't miss his birthday. That that's the lie. Yes, that is a lie. Because I was about to say you went to you you went to Cheston Middle School. And that was connected to Cheston High School. No, it wasn't. Right? No? I said my old middle school and high school. Oh, that's right. Okay, yeah. I went to Shoemate Middle School and Carson High School in Michigan, and you could literally walk through a door and go to the high school. They, the building That's right. You told me stories about other. that, yeah. I just thought it was Cheston Middle School. Cheston Middle School is not connected to the high school. It used yeah. to be the high school. It it's used not connected. to be the high school. That's what happened. That's what it was. Okay. And I know you know about the bridge thing because I told you that when I got back from New York. Yeah. Okay. My turn? Yeah. You have one point. Uh, I, what? You have one point so far. Yep. Uh, I've been, I have been to two school dances, only two school dances. Uh, I've been to one because we went to one together. I have never left the country and I have had a girlfriend. Well, I know you've been to at least one school dance if you're counting prom. I am counting prom. Okay, because I know we went together with a yeah. big group of people. Um, so I've only been to one other school dance. I've never left the country or I've had a girlfriend. One of those is a lie. See, I can believe the school dance one because we're both not big on school dances. The girlfriend, eh, I'm kind of swaying. Never left the country, I can also believe that. I'm going to say the girlfriend is a lie. That is correct. That is a lie. Yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, I, I, I do not like school dances. 
Yeah, I was gonna say neither of us really do. You I was the, the I think school dance most, I ever went to. I think I was the most against going to prom, and then we act, and then we like made a plan. I'm like, okay, this sounds dope, and I went and I decided to go. <laughs> okay. I think Ben convinced me to go because he's like, we don't even have to go for the whole thing. I'm like, okay, cool. Ben is the other person you see on the channel, by the way, guys. Okay, so my third one. Yes. I've never been to Disney World or Universal Studios. I have never been on a boat across the Detroit River. And I have never been to another country. I'm pretty sure you... I'm going to say the never been to another country is false. Because I'm pretty sure you've been to... I think you've been to France. So that one's a lie? Yeah, I think the other country... Never been to another country is a lie. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Ah. The I have never been to Disney World or Universal Studios is a lie. I've, yeah, I was, I was thinking that one, and then you said and then you said that, and I got the inkling of a thought you told me you went to Paris or something like that. Well, I said the school had a trip to go to Paris, but my mom told me no. Oh, that's good, Paris. right. Um, Dang it. I mean, I guess you could count Canada, since I was on the Ambassador Bridge, and I went over the border. Technically on the bridge for like a minute, but not really. I'm not gonna count that. Because I actually never walked into Canada. I was just on the bridge. We well, never, uh, never recre recreationally went to Canada. And then I have never been on a boat across the Detroit River. I've been on the Detroit River, but I never went across it. And then I have been to Universal Studios, but I haven't been to Disney World. So that one's a lie. So you, you know, I, the reason I was going with that one is because I was so specifically both of them. I'm like. Ah, they're not the same. <laughs> no, they're two separate. But, like, but usually if you go to Florida. one, you go to the other. Okay. I haven't been to Disney World, but I have been to Universal Studios. Yeah. I did ride the okay. Simpsons ride. That was fun. My turn? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I have shot a gun. I have been hunting. And I have been in a tank. Wait, you said you have a gun? I've... Shot a gun. Oh. I've shot a gun. In America, who has been hunting, and I've been in a tank. You're in America. Who hasn't? You you lived in Illinois, the shooting capital of, like, the United States. <laughs> so I'm going to say yes on that one. Hunting, shooting guns, correlates. Tank is kind of a weird one. Kind of throw me off a bit. I'm going to say... The hunting one is a lie. That is correct. That is a lie. I would say the tank is so weird and out there that it has to be true. Yeah. But you got to tell me the story. Tell me, how were you in a tank? I was in a tank because my um, my family, uh, we went on a we went on a trip to this uh, tank memorial kind of thing. Um, and they had this uh, replica tank that you can go in. And you oh, kind of real tank. No, no, no. It was like it was like a replica tank that you that could be driven around, but there was like an attendant inside that drove it around, and there was like a target that he shot at and all that. Mm -hmm. I don't remember what it's called or where it is, but I remember I distinctly remember going there and doing that whole thing. Okay. So I've been in a tank that works and shoots. Okay, so that was number four for you, right? Yep. Yeah, so How many points do you have? Um, I have two. Yeah, because you got the girlfriend and tank. Yeah. Yeah, and then you have one. Girlfriend. The birthday. Yeah. But other than that, you missed the other two. So I'm winning right now by one. Mm -hmm. So you got to tie it up here, Matt. Yeah, I do. Oh, number four for me. I used to take piano lessons. I used to have a dirt bike. And I have only visited 13 states in the United States. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I made this one hard. Mm. <laughs> you have a dirt bike. I said I used to have a dirt bike. You used to. Okay. I was say, did you I say used to take piano lessons for the first two. And then uh, I have only visited 13 states was the last one. Okay. 
Because you think, see, my thing is, my thing with piano lessons is I know your brother. Yes. And I know, and I know your family. And knowing them, they, Alec well, I have, hate music. <laughs> I know, but he would have asked. Well, I to, hate making music. I like listening yeah, to music. He, he would have asked to get piano lessons. And then they would have been like, hey, Jacob, why don't you try out like one lesson? And then you're very wrong. That, like piano lessons. Alec never asked for piano lessons. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you the story after you guess. Then there's, you used to have a dirt bike. You lived in Michigan, so I can believe that. What are you trying um, to say? <laughs> I said I lived near Detroit. <laughs> Not out in the country. I can believe it even more. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's Michigan. They make vehicles for a living. <laughs> Not anymore. Not with quarantine. Not only uh, like face mask things. Um, and then there's... Although it is boosting Detroit's economy. <laughs> what was the last one? Um, I have only visited 13 states. That That's just a numbers game right there. I know you visited... Yeah. You can try to guess which... And count which states I've been to. <laughs> I know you've been to... Well, you just told me Orlando, so Florida. Yeah. Um, Then there's also New York. Yes. I'm not sure if you're counting Indiana or not. Wait, I'm sitting in Indiana. See, the, the way I count it, it uh -huh. if I stayed there a night or stayed there and walked around, it counts. Okay. Like, the road trip, if I drove straight through a state, like to Florida, I drove straight through Tennessee, that doesn't count. But, okay. um, my, like, in Pennsylvania, I'm basically giving you a state, we stopped to get gas and stayed there for about a half an hour on our way to New York, so I count that one, because I stayed there. You said at least 11? Or um, 11? I've only visited 13. 13, okay. You guys had to count? <laughs> I'm not going to try counting. No. <laughs> I'm going to say you... Um, now I think of it, you might... I think you told me a story about your dirt bike. I don't think so. I don't remember really talking about it. I feel like I remember this. Um, you must have had a, remember a long time ago when we first met because I haven't talked about it in a long time. I, I want to say, I want to say, it's a hard one, isn't it? I'm going to say you, you, it's just so specific, 13 states. <laughs> I want to say that's the lie, but it's so specific. <laughs> piano lessons, piano lessons. 13 states. Huh? The thing is, <laughs> you do you do dislike making music? The only thing I should throw you off is that I don't really like to ride dirt bikes or anything like that because I think they're dangerous and I feel like I would get hurt. <laughs> what? Oh. What? Um. I wonder if that's going to be in the video. I hope not. <laughs> It said your internet connection is unstable on my screen, so I hope that's not in the video. I want to say, I'm I'm 100 lowballing it. I'm guessing it here. I want to say the specific one. You have not been just to 13 states. It might be higher, it might be lower, but you've not been to 13. Specifically, right. 13. What? You're right. Yes. So that's two points each. Yeah, I've actually been to 12 states. I just added one. Remember when we were making the thing and I was counting? Yeah. That's why I was counting. I didn't actually remember that. I wasn't actually looking. <laughs> I counted 12 and then just added one. Um, yeah. But yeah, piano lessons, you thought Alec asked for them? No. Um, My mom just decided to sign us up for them at the mall. So, uh, <laughs> Since uh, she always had to go to the mall, she would drop us off at piano lessons at the music store and then go do her shopping. And that's how Alec got a piano, because I hated it, and I would just sit there waiting for my turn to be over, and Alec would get really into it. That's how he got into music. Nice. And then the dirt bike, we bought that um, 
from someone in Michigan, I don't remember who, but we used to have like this house near Detroit with like uh, this field and stuff and we would uh, drive it there. And then when we moved, we sold it again because my mom said we couldn't take it to India. Because she said she doesn't think it's a state where people like dirt bikes or something like that. Like dirt bikes are allowed in the certain place we're going. So we were like, okay, let's sell it. Okay. So uh, your fifth one. This could this could win it. This it's all up to this. If you don't get this, we're tied. But if you don't get it too, we're still tied. Wait, is that number four for you? That was number four. We both have one left. Oh, we all have one left. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I thought that was number five for you. <laughs> no, remember because you started. Yeah. Uh, okay. Number five. I've been on two dates. Uh, I have. What kind of dates I are you have, talking about? What? Are we talking about like Tinder Romantic dates? Romantic dates. Are we talking about like days of the week dates? No, no, like. Because <laughs> I know you've been on more than two of those. <laughs> <laughs> like romantic dates. Planned and everything, okay? Okay. Have been, I have been dumped in 20, within 24 hours. So the relationship started and then ended within 24 hours. Man, you're very quick, so I can believe that. And then uh, I have never been a girl's wingman. A girl's wingman? A girl's wingman. I have never been a girl's wingman. Mm. Uh, ah. What would you say? Ah. Hard? Mm. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> we were just talking about the girlfriend earlier. Now they're all three. Mm. I'm going to say number one, two, or three is a lie. Thank you. Thank you. Now, specifically, <laughs> which one's a lie? <laughs> I'm a telecab, right? You are correct. Sir, yes. <laughs> Great. Okay, let's move on to the next one. <laughs> mm. I, you hit him again? I'm going to say... The ah, <laughs> mm. oh, it's so hard. I'm gonna say number three. Final answer. Yes. That is correct. Yeah, <laughs> three points. Uh, I've only been on two dates. Uh, I have been dumped within twenty four hours. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> and I have been a girl's wingman. I'm not going to say who. Oh, you should tell me. You know them, though. You know them, though. You should tell me after the video. I can tell you. Yeah, I'll tell you after the video. Okay, um, so you need to win this or I win. But if you yeah. win this, then we tie. Yeah. What's going to happen if we tie? Well, we just tie. Okay, sweet. Bragging rights. What? We both get bragging rights. Nice. We get bragging rights over Ben. All right. Final one. My family used to own a barn. I won second place in the Pinewood Derby in Boy Scouts. And I almost had a sister. Hmm. Difficult? No, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to pull together some continuity here. Can you repeat them, please? Sure. My family used to own a barn. Okay. I won second place in the Pinewood Derby in Boy Scouts. I almost had a sister. Hmm. I think I know what you're thinking. You mean continuity? Huh? What do you mean continuity? From what you've said before. Yes. So, putting one event together with another event, seeing if they match up. Oh, that's what you're just trying to do? I mean, it kind of does, but number two is kind of suspicious. Why? Because you're the one that want, went and said that Boy Scouts only has four years. So, I'm kind of suspicious on that front. 
But that, then again, you could have just not been in the Boy Scouts for long. I was. Uh, I can tell you right now. Hmm. I was only in Boy Scouts for a year. Okay. Before I dropped it. But I did do the Pinewood Derby. Yeah. That was fun. I actually still have the the tank from it. Yeah, I've seen it. Pinewood Derby. Yeah, that's a... I said I got second place in the Pinewood Derby for the second one. My family used to own a barn, and I almost had a sister. I'm pretty sure the sister one is correct. Um, pretty sure you've mentioned something about that. Um, mm-hmm. Pretty sure you've mentioned something about that. Mm-hmm. Pinewood Derby is still suspicious to me. Mm-hmm. Um, even though I know you have the thing. <laughs> I can show you my tank if you want. I know. I've seen the tank. I've been in your room. I've and I can show tank. you my trophy when we're done, but I'm not going to show you now because it says what place I got. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about right there. I think that's the lie. I think the lie is what place you got. I think you totally did the Pinewood Derby. And I think you totally were in Boy Scouts because I know you were in Boy Scouts for a year. You just said it. I think you did the Pinewood <laughs> Derby. I just don't think you got first place or second place. What was the last one? You used to own a barn? Uh, the first one was my family used to own a barn. You look confused. <laughs> I mean, you used to live in a house near Detroit. Ah. Oh. Yeah, we're like ten minutes away from Detroit. Like we could see downtown from our house, but we went like right in downtown. We went there a yeah. lot though. I'm going to say I know you have a trophy I know you have the tank I'll tell you after the video I'm going to say that's the lie I'm going to say Pinewood Derby is a lie Final answer? That's the final answer You are Correct. Yes. I did not win second place in the Pinewood Derby. I won first place, bitches. I had to cheat, but my dad showed me to cheat, so I did a cheat. <laughs> How'd you cheat? Um, so, like, here, let me show you. Wait, didn't you have other people do it for you? No, 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 no. That's not how I cheated. Uh, me and Alec did build ours together, but when we were building them, you see the wheel here. Um, right here, this axle. My dad yeah. uh, put this oil on it. This uh, like uh, special oil he had, so that when wow, this is dusty. <laughs> so that when uh, it went down the track, it was like two times faster than everyone else's. Oh wow! Because it was all oiled up, so it spun a lot faster. Because everyone else's, theirs was wedged into the wood. It didn't spin as fast. So I oh. cheated because I put oil on it. <laughs> well, now we're tied. Uh, this video is already half an hour long. Oh, really? It's 29 minutes right now. Well, I can't really think of anything we could do to break it. So I guess now we're just both get bragging rights, I guess. Great, we both get bragging rights. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, we might do a part two of this video, either with just me and Matt again, or maybe with Ben as well. Um, leave your comments, see what other challenges and stuff you want us to do, and we'll see you guys later.